Yay! All right, so we're starting the vlog a little bit late because we have inclement weather and special circumstances. Today is Saturday, it's almost four o'clock, and we are gonna vlog probably until Monday or Tuesday because we're actually getting snow, which is super exciting. Like the real kind of snow, guys, not flurries, like snow, snow. So that's gonna be super exciting. Today's Saturday, we're about to make some chili, and then tomorrow's Sunday, it's Valentine's Day. This stud muffin over here is on call. Hopefully he doesn't get called in because the roads are atrocious in Dallas. And then Monday, we're supposed to get five to 10 inches of snow. Y'all are looking at my Valentine's Day flowers. My boyfriend sent them to me. See, my boyfriend, my forever boyfriend. <laughs> We're about to make chili and then the boys come back tomorrow. The girls are here now. The boys come back tomorrow and then everyone has Monday and Tuesday off because of the snow. Y'all, I'm telling you, if a tornado hits Dallas, we're like, tornado schmornado, we got this. But if it's icy or snowy, Dallas is like, we have no idea what to do. So we close schools and roads and everything. <laughs> so it has been so chilly. The house is so dry from the heater. Everyone has like chapped skin, chapped feet, chapped lips. So we got humidifiers running. Uh, everyone's craving like soup, chili, pot roast. Y'all, we had to go grocery shopping and it was like, post-apocalyptic grocery store. Everyone was stocking up on stuff. Yesterday, I did my very first Amazon Live and that was super exciting. I was so nervous. Y'all, I don't get nervous. I never get nervous. Rare occasion that I get nervous. My mom always makes fun of me because she's like, man, you're not even scared of the naked devil. And it's true, you know? Fearless to the max, but I got so nervous right before doing it. And it was so much fun. I really enjoyed it. So I think we're gonna keep doing it maybe every Friday for now and see how we how we do. The other thing I wanted to tell you guys is I would love to gather up all my prayer warriors. I know there's a ton of us out there that love prayer calls. My dad actually suffered a heart attack last week and he went in for surgery, had two stents put in. And it's such a surreal experience when you can't be there, especially even if you could, even my mom couldn't go in with him because of the pandemic. So it's been a very stressful time. I know my poor family has been dealing with Moody Danny for about a week now because it's just, when you're so far away, it's frustrating, but when you're so far away and you still can't do anything about it, had you been, had the opportunity to be there. So anyway, he's, he's made a full recovery already. It was, it's a miracle, but it's still, oh, all right. Do you want to say excuse me? That's not how a lady behaves. That's not how a lady behaves. <laughs> She felt the tension. She was like, I need to distract my mom. <laughs> so anyway, if you guys are, are in the mood or are looking for people to pray for, I know there are a lot of prayer groups that are pandas and are part of this community. I would really, really appreciate it. But anyway, every vlog, you guys, every vlog has a little bit of real life information. There was that for this vlog. <laughs> Tomorrow's Valentine's Day and I'm very excited because we're gonna spend the day with the kids. We have a little special treat planned for them, so that's gonna be, that's been the highlight of my week. I've been looking forward to doing that with them. So tomorrow will be super fun, but right now, it's only a matter of time before everyone gets roaringly hungry. So we're gonna get started and do some chili. Which brings me to our husband and wife argument episode 136. If you make chili, do you do it with beans or without beans? Parker? Without. <laughs> There's a leaf on your back. You're not making a very good argument right now, sir. See the leaf. I found a leaf in our bed yesterday. <laughs> it's probably the dogs. It's a little bitty leaf. Yeah, the it dogs. On, it was on your side. So Parker and I had an argument inside the, uh, at the Walmart parking lot. Like it was literally in a Walmart parking lot. So it was very appropriate to have an argument there, you know? He was saying like, 
he was planning on making chili and I was like, no, because anytime you make chili, you don't put beans in it. And he's like, you're not supposed to. And I was like, I'm sorry, if you don't, it's basically sloppy joes. And he's like, I know, it's awesome. And I'm like, no. And he's like, it's poor people food. And we always have this conversation about how poor people food is so good. We both grew up with very humble beginnings and we know what it's like to make a lot of meals with very little ingredients. So I was like, no. If it's poor people food, you can't afford a full pot of ground beef. You add the beans as filler, right? <laughs> so we compromise and we're making chili with beans. <laughs> Here's my food prep. Here's my dog's food that we just made. And here's my other food prep right here. We're gonna make some chili. I got my tomato sauce ready over here. I got my petite diced tomatoes. They didn't have the ones I normally get. These will do. However, I do have a carton of Italian crushed tomatoes. I think I might get fancy, you guys. I think I might get fancy with the chili. Um, and then the other thing that we're gonna do, I don't know if we're gonna do it today or wait until the boys get here tomorrow, but this came in my FabFitFun and when we went to Walmart, Parker got some soil. So we're gonna plant some basil, some Italian basil. Do you guys wanna see my Valentine's Day present? You're not ready for this. You have to get ready. You have to promise me. Are you ready? I'll give you a minute. How about now? You ready? <laughs> it's so little! Mita! It's a measuring cup! Look! Watch this! Oh, Bubble, you gonna cook? <laughs> Can you cook for Mama? <laughs> no, you're ruining. You're ruining the shop, man. Here, Bubble, cook for Mama. You gonna cook for Mama? It's like, M woman, leave me alone. Look, just put your paw. Put your paw on the handle. Just put your paw on the handle. There. See? Isn't that the best pre <laughs> best present ever? <laughs> He's like, Randon, rescue me. <laughs> rescue me, Randon. Oh. So we were adventuring through the aisles at Walmart and Parker was looking for an injector for a pork butt that he wants to make. Not this week because it's too cold. And I saw this and I asked him if we could get it and he said no. And then I said, but I want it. And he said, no. And I said, but I need it. And he said, you're never going to use it. So we compromised and we bought it. It was $1.99. But he said it had to be my Valentine's Day present. <laughs> Look how little it is. <laughs> okay, that's enough, that's it. Me, 
Bobby. <laughs> Hi, sweet boy. Come on, come on, Dumbo. Hey, eh? Dumbo. Hey, hey. Come on, come on. There's so much! Yeah! Stretch, stretch, get ready, get ready. Game on, and... Ready? Go! Go! Oh. Oh, she sniffs it like she's investigating. <gasps> what is that? <gasps> what is that? <gasps> what is that? Where are you going, man? Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. You need a pee? She's not taking advantage of the driveway. It's like smooth canvas. Mern, go. Mern, get her. Mern, where's Taryn? Get Taryn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she discovered the driveway. Ernie, go. Get Taryn. Where is she? Get her. Where? Get her. Look. Get the girls. Ah! Oh my god, it's snowing so hard. Come on, Mer. Come on, Mer. Hey, you guys, look who's home. This little handsome mister. Oh, okay. This handsome mister, too. What are you doing? Remember, you gotta use words. <laughs> you guys, it's Valentine's Day. The boys are here. It's snowing. This is the shark. Look at his smile. Isn't he that cute? It's a shark with an anal fin. Look and at that. We learned about shark anatomy this morning. And it's a snow storm. Snow day. It's and Parker made us all breakfast. Look at my pancakes. Do you see that masterpiece? Look at that. I don't even know where to start. It's been, it's been kind of a disaster breakfast morning, but they're delicious. So that's all that matters. The lighting is funky. Oh boy. I think this is gonna be the rest of the vlog. Sorry guys. We're back to super zooms. Super zooms. For the next the next hour of the vlog. <laughs> a little Valentine's Day update. <laughs> Everyone's enjoying themselves. Look, we're almost done. Cause we're awesome. And look at this, look at this nerd. He's going out in the tundra. Cause the kids want cheeseburgers. Myrtle's all about that outdoor life. You love to be outside, huh? My little winter dog. Look at this guy. A father's love. We're doing um, butcher box patties. These are super, super, super easy to do because they have very little shrink, but they're super yummy, super fresh, and super juicy. But they actually like will fit on the bun without shrinking up into like a little meatball. A little meatball. Yeah. <laughs> Am I that predictable? <laughs> I literally said nothing and you're like, yep, it's my time. It's my moment of exploit, 
of exploitation. It's not that cold. I'm barefoot. He's in snow boots. Come on, country boy. You get you get points. Look, you got com you got company. Mine's a snow dog. She snow is. Dog. She I'm loves it. She's been a champ. All right, let's find out what the other nerdies are doing. Hey, are you having a good Valentine's? Are you having a good Valentine's? Can you need to go potty? What, you wanna go potty? You oh. Me to open it up. Oh, that's nice, thank you for helping. Oh, what do you got going on in here? Are you moving out? What is this? I wanna go wherever you're going on this trip with fancy chocolates. Some love. What it? What it? Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Do you have some, can you answer some questions? Is this from from your Chinese New Year? And lunar. L well, that's the same, same thing. Oh yeah. Where's my red envelope? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What are you doing, ma'am? What are you doing, ma'am? You sweet girl. My sweet girl. Y'all, it has been such a lazy day. The snow has made everyone kind of just cozy, lazy, cuddly. It's almost four o'clock, so Parker is cooking us some cheeseburgers. We're gonna have that probably with chips. We already gave the kids their Valentine's, so they're kind of just hanging out, eating candy, munching on that. But we do have this special thing we want to do with them later, after dinner. If they eat their dinner, I'm, I'm, this is basically the highlight of my day. After the highlight of my day, I'm gonna show you what Parker got me for Valentine's Day. Y'all are not gonna believe it. Actually, speaking of, where are my marshmallows? Parker, did one of the kids steal my marshmallows? Oh, oh all right. I was afraid I was gonna have to kill one of the kids, you know? Woo. So, yeah, my Valentine's was so cute. Super exciting, I mean, besides my measuring cup. Parker's Valentine is also really cool, and I'm not gonna tell you what it is. I'll just show you and see if you guys can make the connection from his gift to last weekend's vlog. But for now, we're gonna enjoy some cheeseburgers. I may show you our cool activity that we have planned. It involves eating, but that's it. I almost burned the house down right now with the cast iron griddle because if you guys have anything cast iron, anywhere there is cast iron, the heat is even. That's why people love to cook on cast iron because it doesn't cool. If you put like a cold steak on here, it doesn't drop the temperature of the pan, but the heat is even. Anywhere there is cast iron is even heat. So I accidentally grabbed the handle, burned myself, got really mad, and so I shoved an oven mitt on the handle so I wouldn't do that again. And then look at what happened. I was like, is somebody burning something? Oh wait, that's somebody with me. I'm burning the house down. You guys, this is our Valentine's Day surprise. We need a hand for reference. Okay, this is the hand for size reference. Oh, we're hitting, like all hands for size reference. On deck. <laughs> so a few years ago, I would say maybe last year, we got a heart a box of heart, a heart shaped box of chocolates, and we spent what the whole afternoon? A large portion of the evening. Yeah, eating eating them and like sharing and finding out what centers were. And we saw this at Walmart the other day and I told Parker, I was like, wouldn't this be fun to do with the kids? Look, look how many. <gasps> oh no, oh no, Randon's face. Everyone look at Randon's face, we're in trouble. We're gonna have we're... a repeat of the cage. <laughs> Dang it. Repeat. Look at how cool, it has a guide, no, throw it away. Yeah, that's cheating. Right? Do you want to use the guide or no guide? No guide. No guide. <laughs> no guide. Wait, no, so this is watch. this is what we're gonna do. This is we're gonna t they're repeats, right, girls? Or no? Some. I think some are similar. But well, there's supposed similar. to be a white chocolate truffle, and there's I don't see anything white. We got hosed, y'all. Yeah. This is what happens when you buy chocolates at Walmart. Well, summer, amazingness. Because well, y'all don't like white chocolate. Well, some <laughs> black. 
Like dark chocolate? The girls are cheating, Parker. Look, Look. criminals. Oh, time criminals. No. no? no. Oh, this has got nuts what is in this? It. Nuts. It's nutty. Nuts. All right. This is a dark chocolate. Let's. Hey, give me the thing. <laughs> Can't be trusted with such <laughs> power. <laughs> Monday. All right, so yesterday was super fun. It was a very relaxing day for all of us. And we kept getting notifications from like all our electric companies and on Instagram, if we follow anything that's like local, it was like, you're on alert, energy conservation, keep your thermostats at 68, don't run big appliances, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Well, we're under like a state of emergency right now where they're having to do rolling blackouts in order for everyone to have power. And so right now, since 1 a.m. we've been having 45 minutes on, 45 minutes off in terms of anything power related. So right now we're in the middle of our 45 minutes off, which means no electricity, like to any capacity. And since 1 a.m. our fridge has been 45 minutes on, 45 minutes off, so all of our food is not as cold as it should be. So it's been... <laughs> It's been very um, telling to discover how dependent I am on all my luxuries. <laughs> the boys are like, the internet doesn't work. My YouTube doesn't work. My Fortnite doesn't work. And I'm like, that's what a power outage means. Leon doesn't work. The lamp doesn't work. The dogs, the poor dogs are freezing cold. So we're all bundled up. This one has his little fox robe on. And we're... We are almost dead because we're missing one piece of a puzzle. Yeah, we need to talk to our friend Nathan. We have enjoyed doing this dog puzzle so much and we finished it this morning, but we're missing a piece. Probably totally our fault. So today, I think what we're gonna focus on with our power outages is trying to find the missing piece. But you guys, the puzzle is so cute. Look at that. Isn't it cute? There's so many dogs. I think the only one missing on here is Mern. But we had a, a really, 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 really fun Wesley. time doing it. We all took turns. Sophia. But we're missing this one little piece right there. And Shiva. See that little gap? So we're gonna spend the rest of the day trying to figure out what's gonna happen. Rumor has it that we're gonna be in this kind of situation until Wednesday. Today's Monday. Good times, guys. Good times. So the plan for the boys' school is to have snow days. Today's a holiday. So they, the plan is, if this kind of weather continues, is they're gonna have a snow day tomorrow, Wednesday, and then they're gonna do like digital distance learning Thursday and Friday, but it's too soon to tell. I mean, the weather could completely change in a matter of hours. So for now, in the meantime, all we're doing is just hanging out with no power. 
Yeah. It's kind of weird that they're doing rolling blackouts for 45 minutes. Got a notification from the electric company that our rolling blackouts would only last 20 minutes at a time. And then we got an update one that said they're gonna last 45 minutes but up to two hours. And if you happen to be on the grid that last two hours, you have to let them know because that's a mistake. Anyway, so that's it. I thought I had more exciting news for you guys. So the good news is we have a gas stove. See, this is one of the reasons why a gas stove is a great, is a great investment because fire. So if we need a cook or anything, at least we can do that. <laughs> you guys, it's so cold. We're having to double bundle the doggies. Look how cute. He's all nice and warm. Wesley, we made him a little, a little cocoon over here. Sophie, show me your jacket. Show me your jacket. Look, she's wearing a sweater and a coat. And I told Parker, I was like, hey, listen, even against her will, let's put a t-shirt at least on Mern because with the rolling blackouts, the house gets really, really cold. And by the time it heats back up, it's freezing in here. It's like 62 degrees in here right now. Look at this one. This one even has a nasty little cough right now. Like his little congestion. Oh, what's going on? Is Papa putting a shirt on you so you're nice and warm? I mean, the fact that she's been in her crate with a blanket, she hates blankets, says how cold she is. You like your blue shirt? You match your Papa right now. Oh, that's nice. Oh, <laughs> oh that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Let me let her out. <laughs> Look, are you a Visco girl? <laughs> she, she wants it loose with bike shorts <laughs> and a hydro flask. Hey, where's your scrunchie? You want scrunchie too? Yeah. Oh, you want scrunchie? Come on, Martin, let's go. Let's go running. On your cool t-shirt. I'll run. Be free. Be free. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Do you like it? What do you think? Oh, she wants to go back in. Well, she's not, she's not upset, so she is cold. <laughs> I think she wants to go back in. Double. <laughs> Cuddle time. Where's the uh, joint thing? Oh, in here. Daniel, open this door. Okay, look in here. There's a gray purse. Gray purse. A little gray purse. Oh. I see it. Yep, that's it. Pull it out. Give it to Parker. Little gray. Oh, Martin, you look so pretty. You look so pretty. You want to go wake up the girls? Ha, 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 ha,